This afternoon is morning following that particular tragic incident that befell the Hillside Academy in Nyeri County. We have been able to dispatch our very abled Kevin Washira to that particular scene and he will brief us to the progress that has been made within the institution following the death of young and bright souls, 17 of them and others injured who are currently recuperating in various health facilities within the devolved unit. And of course, we'll get you details of that and so much more. The president all the way from China had has condoled with the family, friends, as well as relatives and the schooling fraternity, the Deputy President, Prime Cabinet Secretary, former Prime Minister, that is Raila Molodinga, among other leaders and officials within the country who have been able to condole with the family. And here from the Kenya Broadcasting Corporation, we do condole with you families from Nyeri County following that particular incident. Of course, the schooling fraternity at large as well in the country. Welcome to our broadcast at this hour. My name is Abdiaziz Ashim, the sign language interpreter at the bottom end of the screen is Anne Wangeshi. And of course, we start off with that note. And of course, the president also spoke on that particular issue. We're getting details of that and so much more at uh, this hour. Uh, also, we've heard from none other than the government spokesperson, that is uh, Dr. Isaac Mora, just giving us a brief on what has uh, transpired within the institution following that uh, Thursday night inferno. Uh, in that particular statement, he has confirmed that at least 17 pupils or students um, have died following that particular tragic incident with more than 14 other Others are being taken to Madari. Now that is the information we have for you. 17 have been confirmed dead while 14 have been injured in that particular statement that has been issued by the government spokesperson that is Isaac Mwaura. Now the affected are the dormitory housing that housed boys from grades 4 to 8. A total of 156 uh, boys were residing in that particular dormitory. Now emergency services are still determining the final number of fatalities with updates to follow as more information becomes available right now the government agencies as well as security operators have boots on the ground you can see that was the earlier scenes this morning once the parents as well as investigators who had flocked to the institution following that particular incident in that particular statement some of the ongoing intervention that the government has put in place is the dry foods and supply of 50 bags of rice and 50 bags of beans uh, are en route to the site via the special programs. 100 mattresses and 100 blankets are also being dispatched with an estimated arrival. Of course, will be uh, in the next a few minutes or so, they will be able to receive uh, those supplies. Medical supplies also are currently on the way with the Ministry of Health and the County Government Health Department of Nyeri now on site assessing the medical needs of the students as well who are residing in that particular institution during that particular Thursday night incident. The Pangjan Foundation has donated 50 first aid kits which will be also sent to the institution. Uh, MP Shah Hospital is also sending uh, medical consumables. The State Department of Education, led by none other than the Cabinet Secretary, that is uh, Honorable Migos, are also reaching 